A small town staple on Long Island was in danger of closing its doors. That is until their customers stepped in at the 11th hour. CBS 2's Steve Overmeyer has the story. In the small village of Williston Park, Hildebrand's old-fashioned soda shop has been a staple for nearly 100 years. What does this place mean to you? It means home in many ways. It's just like going back to your youth. Stepping through these doors is a journey back in time. This week, the building was on the verge of being sold to a company wanting to turn it into a state-of-the-art coffee shop. When they broke the news to the customers on social media, the response was overwhelming. The whole town, they were really upset. Here, 35 years, and it's my life. You know, we've, we've put a lot of time and effort into it. They really didn't want to see it just disappear. Hildebrand's opened in 1927. The neon sign is original. Over the years, countless smiling faces have bellied up to this marble counter waiting for their own homemade Sunday, sure to brighten their day. The thought of losing this piece of history would affect all generations. I was emotionally upset about it, to be honest. I was losing something that I had come now for the last 22 years here to have my fix of ice cream. Within hours of the post, the community comments reached the thousands. Because of that, a potential buyer backed out. We saw all those messages about how nostalgic this place is and how much it means to the community. He did the right thing. A new buyer has stepped in and has made it very clear Hildebrands will remain at the heart of this charming village. Whether you're looking for ice cream or something more hearty. Bacon, eggs, onion ring, uh, onions, tomato, avocado. Oh, so it's got the avocado, so it's healthy. Yeah, yeah. Brimming with nostalgia and unapologetically old-fashioned, too many of these darlings of yesteryear have become forgotten, preserved only by photos. In an impermanent world, this little ice cream shop has become and will remain a fixture. In Williston Park, Long Island, Steve Overmeyer, CBS 2 News.